a new challenger emerges. Anzu Robotics takes flight. The drone industry is about to get interesting. Anzu Robotics, a new player based in the United States, is launching a bold challenge to the industry giant DJI. Anzu's new drones, the Raptor and Raptor T, are designed to go head-to-head -head with DJI's popular Mavic 3 Enterprise series. Anzu is betting big on two key factors, U.S. manufacturing and data security. These are areas where DJI, a Chinese company, has faced scrutiny in recent years. Concerns about data privacy and national security have led some U.S. government agencies and businesses to seek alternative drone providers. Anzu is positioning itself to capitalize on this growing demand for made-in-America drones. Anzu's entry into the market comes at a pivotal time. The global drone industry is booming, with applications ranging from aerial photography and videography to infrastructure inspection and agriculture. As drones become increasingly sophisticated and integrated into sensitive operations, the importance of data security and national origin cannot be overstated. Anzu's challenge to DJI is a sign of things to come as geopolitical factors reshape the drone industry. Raptor vs Mavic, a tale of two drones. So how do Anzu's new Raptors stack up against DJI's Mavic 3 Enterprise drones? Both offer impressive features for professional users, but there are key differences. Let's start with the specs. The Raptor and Raptor T boast comparable flight times and ranges to the Mavic 3E and 3T, making them suitable for a variety of missions. Camera capabilities are crucial for professional drone operations. Here, Anzu has opted for a modular system. The Raptor series can be equipped with different payloads depending on the task at hand. This allows for greater flexibility compared to the fixed camera design of the Mavic 3 Enterprise series. Both Anzu and DJI offer specialized software for mission planning, flight control, and data analysis. These software ecosystems are critical for professional users who rely on drones for complex operations. Made in America Anzu's strategic advantage. One of Anzu's most significant advantages is its U.S. manufacturing base. The company's drones are designed and engineered here in the U.S., however it is assembled in Malaysia. This strategic choice helps to mitigate potential security concerns associated with Chinese manufactured drones. This is a key differentiator from DJI, which manufactures its drones in China. For U.S. government agencies and certain businesses, the Made in America label carries significant weight. It provides reassurance about data security, supply chain integrity, and compliance with U.S. regulations. Anzu is tapping into this sentiment by emphasizing its commitment to domestic production. This strategic decision could give Anzu a significant edge in securing contracts with security-conscious customers. Section 4. Data Security – A Key Battleground in the Drone Wars Data security is paramount in today's digital landscape and the drone industry is no exception. Anzu is making a big bet that its focus on data security will resonate with customers who are wary of DJI's Chinese roots. Anzu emphasizes that its drones are designed with data security as a top priority. The company claims that its drones do not collect or transmit data to any external servers, including Anzu's own. This data minimization approach aims to alleviate concerns about sensitive information falling into the wrong hands. DJI, for its part, has repeatedly denied allegations of data sharing with the Chinese government. However, the company's Chinese origins have led to restrictions on its use by some U.S. government agencies. Anzu's focus on data security could sway customers who prioritize data privacy and regulatory compliance. Section 5. Can Anzu Dethrone the Drone King? Anzu Robotics has entered the drone market with a clear strategy challenge DJI by appealing to customers concerned about U.S. manufacturing and data security. But can Anzu realistically dethrone the Drone King? DJI has a massive head start in the industry. The company has a global reach, a vast product lineup, and a loyal customer base. Overcoming DJI's dominance will be a monumental challenge for Anzu. Anzu's success will depend on several factors. First, the company needs to deliver on its promises of quality, performance, and data security. Second, Anzu must build trust with customers who are accustomed to DJI's products and ecosystem. Third, Anzu needs to expand its sales and distribution channels to reach a wider audience. Section 6. The Future of the Drone Wars, Innovation and Competition Take Flight Anzu Robotics' challenge to DJI is a sign of an evolving drone industry. Geopolitical factors, data security concerns, and the demand for domestic manufacturing are reshaping the landscape. 
Anzu's entry into the market is a positive development for customers who now have more choices and greater leverage. Competition often breeds innovation. As Anzu and DJI vie for market share, we can expect to see both companies pushing the boundaries of drone technology. This will lead to more sophisticated drones with enhanced capabilities, improved safety features, and even stronger data security measures. The drone wars are just beginning, and the ultimate winners will be the customers who benefit from the innovation and competition that Anzu has injected into the industry.